Yo, 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 what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Quanzy coming at y'all with another video today, man. And the video I'm dropping today is all my settings that I use, my controller settings, my graphic settings, my monitor settings, etc. Everything that I use to get the max frames. I think I'm getting like 230 right now. Uh, but yeah, man, we'll go over all that and I'll talk to y'all in the vid about everything I do and why I do it. Um, so first starting off, we got the display settings. Uh, I got my 3080, my refresh rate 280. Uh, what else? I got the reflex low latency on auto, on own and boost. Um, V-Sync, all that off. That's never good. I got that on custom. That's on 100. Um, upscale, fidelity cast. That's what I used on Warzone, so I just brought it over to this. I got the my VRAM scale target on 80. Uh, sometimes they say you can put this on 90, but your game may experience lagging or crashing. If it does, just take it down 10. You know what I'm saying? It'll help fix that. I don't know what this is. I just it just came on, so I just kept it on. It says activate a technique that improves performance at low visual cost by controlling where additional images needed. It sounds like something good, so I guess they just have it on. But as you can see, all my texture resolution and everything, depth of field off, all that's on low, everything low, low, low. I turn the bullet impacts and the persistent effects on. Uh shader quality low, off, normal low off 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 low tessellation on all you can put that on either or but it don't really affect your gpu or the frames that much so i just put it you know what i'm saying on all terrain max um low 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 all that that's my sentence for that i play on 120 affected and i didn't touch any of that other stuff uh that's all my settings as far as my graphics and quality and these are my controller settings uh i play with l1 r1 to shoot um tactical flip basically that's what it's called and i play with that right there that's how you flip the uh l1 r1 these are my dead zones i got it on five five this is a new controller so the dead zones uh i didn't touch anything but the right stick left stint left stick men uh the dead zones really based on the controller you have so if you have a new controller you're not going to have as much input delay so you know what i'm saying you don't have to turn it up as high but if you have that stick drift where like sometimes your controller drifts off then you need to turn it up more the more you turn it up the less that it drifts off and you need to find that sweet spot to the point where it doesn't drift off at all so you know for each controller is different so so each situation is different you know mine's just is on five and for my aim and sensitivity i'm on seven seven point eighty five multiply and that's everything else some people say play on dynamic some people play on linear some people play on standard linear is just more it fits me more i feel like it's more direct like when i turn it it's no uh fast or slow movement it just go direct where you put it at it's like if i turn it right it goes right it's not a slowdown or you know what i'm saying it's just more raw input and i want it to be like that it's directly what i tell it to do you know what i'm saying that's why i think it's personally the best you know what i'm saying um but yeah all this other stuff i didn't touch um aim assist on default i see some people say they turn it to black ops I, I don't know i haven't experienced anything to make me change it but if i ever do i'll update the settings automatic tax tax sprint make sure you have automatic tax sprint on this is just the best to me you know what i'm saying so you can move and sprint and and, and be fast you know um yeah man put it on automatic tax sprint for sure off auto move forward tax sprint double tap these are the rest of the settings y'all see them just go and pause them um prioritize interact But yeah, man. And that's all my settings that I have as far as this game go. I'll show you my audio settings as well. Uh, I got my audio mix on headphone bass boost. Uh, I feel like the audio is a little better in this game than Warzone. You still can't hear anyone if they have covert sneakers, which is dead silence. Even if you have the bone conduction headset perk on, which is crazy to me. Hopefully they fix that. My master volume. I got all the music and stuff off. Voice chat volume. You know what I'm saying? The dialogue and effects up though. I want to hear everything on the game, in the game. Voice chat. Well, yeah, those are all my... 
those are all my audio settings and graphic settings and controller settings and that's pretty much it man peace